Hey, did you guys have a good Christmas? Well, that's good. Because so did I. Hey, welcome to this week's edition of Bonehead Truckers of the Week. This is a place we make fun of the dumb stuff we see out here on the road. So if you like this kind of garbage, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that daggum like button. All right, just go do it. New Year's is coming up. We got a lot of great things coming up in 2024. So if you want to subscribe and be a part of it and watch it, lots of entertainment I'm going to give you. Uh, if you got videos and pictures you want to send to see on Bonehead Truckers, send them to contact at boneheadtruckers.com, okay? We'll get our reaction. Well, we're going to do a reaction because we are the sports center. We're the sports center of freaking trucking, all right? So if you guys want to sit there and say, you talk too much, well, so those guys on sports center, okay? All right, I'm just saying. <laughs> what are you doing up there, truck driver? Huh? What you doing? I ain't supposed to how you do it. How you do this on dry payment? Probably fell asleep. That's just what happens. But doggone. Shame on the mess. Look where you're at. Oh my gosh, is that the driver? Oh, the sit of shame. <laughs> the, the sit of shame. Uh, anyways, uh, what is this guy doing in the neighborhood? Oh, go! What you do? Where, where you going? You following your phone's GPS? That's not how you supposed to do it. Oh, uh, shame on the mess. Anyway, what we got going on up here? A big truck doing four wheeler stuff. Say, hey, I missed my exit. That's okay. I'm just going to do this crap right here. I don't care if nothing happens. Oh, right now. Doggone FedEx right here is trying to get over, and this guy sends me this, and I'm like, I see his blinker. You could have let him over there, four-wheeler. I'm just sitting there saying, you could have let him over. Gosh, why are you giving guys such a hard time? I mean, I, I get it. He's FedEx. to be funny. All right, we'll see him, but doggone. Then we got this guy pulling out here. Doesn't even stop and look. Just pull out. Just pull out. That's okay because I drive a large car. All right. I can go do that if I want to because look at me. I'm something special. Anyway, this guy, and he just won't speed up. He won't go. Jeez. Just, just, just do this. All right. Yeah, yeah, we'll just do this. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, what what a heck of a stop there. Maybe his brakes didn't work. That's what it is. Oh, guy stopped. He didn't even stop for the freaking stop sign. Love it. Just love it. Love it, love it, love it. Alright, hey, uh, this guy left the freaking truck stop right here. He, uh, well, he didn't do something. He didn't do a pre-trip. Or maybe he pissed someone off and someone pulled his pin. Something. Uh, because guess what? Now you're over there looking dumb. Ooh, man. Oh, no. What's she doing? What you doing? You looking over there? What you doing over there? I ain't supposed to say you do it. What you doing over there? Jeez. Uh, oh, uh, look at old Prime. He's got to go to the truck stop here. He stops. I mean, he just leaves you and you look when he stops. Just pulls right out in front of that daggum four wheeler. Hey Prime, do you not see that guy? Open up your eyes there, driver. Open up your eyes! <laughs> this guy just pulls out in front of this guy. And uh well it runs the red light. Just just drive straight on through it. He says screw it. Doesn't even matter that guy. That guy says red light, ah, who cares? Screw it. I'm just gonna run them all. 
Uh, these guys, that's the thing this video, ain't no one stopping. Just stop. Anyway. Here we go, guys. Listen, don't watch bonehead truckers going down the road. That's what this guy may be doing. It's like he's just weaving in and out of traffic or, or, you know, in his lane there. Then we got the super ego guy right here. We got the super ego and it's like, okay, lane closed. I'm going to try to get ahead of everybody. And then you got this guy. It's the battle of the egos right here. I tell you what. But someone is going to have to replace a mirror, I suppose. Oh my god. Oh my god is right. Oh, you should just let him out. Just be Bill patient. Let, let, let his ego. Hey, I thought Christmas was over. Huh? Let's get to summertime. Yeah, that's what I love about Christmas. So I love about Christmas is because, hey, <laughs> winter just started. Oh, yeah. I don't like winter. All right. I think I... I live in Texas, but to me, it's not south enough. <laughs> you know, jeez. Oh yeah. Uh, good old I'll have to get out there and do the crank of shame. Oh boy, and those trailers are heavy too, man. I used to pull. I used to pull Walmart trailers. I used to pull, pull for Walmart, man. And yeah, those trailers are usually pretty heavy. Yeah, just go sit there and look at it, because it's not gonna go up. Uh, just, just sit there and look at it. <laughs> anyway. I, here's the uh, here's a truck right there. See the protractor? See that? And uh, well, look right right up here. There's the trailer. How? How? What the crap? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I, I would love to see that video on how that actually happened. Of course, those things ain't got no brakes. Go figure. <laughs> Go figure. Ain't got no dang brakes. Junky. Speaking of someone, all these people not stopping. I mean, crackheads. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just, let's not stop today. Then you got old freaking Schneider going over here doing a U turn on a two lane highway. That ain't how you do it there, Schneider. Look at him. He's all stuck. Look at him. All stuck. Here we got this guy right here. I don't even know. How you do that? How in the heck do you even do that over there? Looking dumb. <laughs> what? One of the biggest benefits with partnering with TRC, coming over to TRC, is number one, freedom. This is the absolute closest you'll ever get to being an owner operator without having your own authority. The difference between TRC and another mega care or anything like this is you go where you want to. You got options of health benefits if that's what you want. The support system at TRC, it don't just stop at five o'clock. It don't just stop at four o'clock in the morning. Thanks for watching. I hope that helped you guys understand a little more about TRC Freight. If you have any questions or comments, please reach out to us, trcandme.com.